Kathy McCall. I'm the cemetery director for Golden Gate and San Francisco National Cemeteries. I was born in Seoul, Korea. My dad's a veteran, my brother was a veteran, my nephew, my brother-in-law, cousin. Certainly gave me an appreciation for what veterans did and uh, the, the freedoms that we enjoy because of their service. I joined the Department of Veterans Affairs at the National Cemetery in Portland, and that was my first job with VA, and I loved it. It's the early part of the 20th century when the city of San Francisco uh, decided to prohibit cemeteries from being within the city limits, and uh, there was a demand for burial space for veterans. And so the Department of the Army, which oversaw the National Cemeteries at that time, acquired this property and uh, was approved to be a National Cemetery in 1938. And in 1941, the cemetery opened and performed their first burials. And so it's got a really strong history in the community because of the time that it's been around. When we go on uh, services and accompany families, uh, it's so that we can make it as memorable uh, for that family as possible, so that their loved one is honored uh, in a way that they deserve to be honored. You know, their service to our nation was at great cost, not only to the veteran, but the family as well, and we want to honor that. National cemeteries are an integral part of any community because of the history that is within each cemetery. And learning about one person and that veteran service uh, makes it much more memorable and much more personal. <laughs>